Hey guys, it's Kevin. I'm back with another video. I'm going to try to make a wooden hammer. Uh, when we was working on the knives and stuff, I was using the butt end of a hammer to knock the handle together on that knife. So I figured that would be a good little project. How about we make a wooden hammer? I need one, so I'm going to make one. I got some firewood. I got this from out back. I believe it's all oak. Uh, I don't want anything actually bigger around than this. I might try to make a head out of this and make a handle out of this one. I don't know if I can or not. I don't know if it's big enough. But if not, we're going to find this hammer and a handle. Or head and a handle. So I'm going to try to use this as the head. I'm going to try to take the straightest part of it. Whatever I can. So That's what our project's going to be today. Making a hammer. Wooden one at that. Let's get to it. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to find the best looking piece of this. I see there's some kind of, maybe, I don't know if that's raw or what that is, but I'm going to try to cut a piece of that off. I'm just going to use my bandsaw and uh, cut this stuff on the bandsaw. Let's we'll see what happens. Well, I got three blocks here to choose from, so we'll pick one of the best ones and we'll try to make us a small wooden hammer out of it. I'm not so sure that this piece of wood is thick enough to make a handle out of, but it might be. I'm going to do more than one for sure because you never know if one's going to turn out okay or what. Maybe I'll get one more out of there. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's not going to be hammer handle. I think that's going to be more of a piece of firewood there. I'm just going to use this draw knife to kind of shape out a handle for me. I'm hoping. I have a big enough piece of wood to give me a rough handle. Have a lot of fire starter here. I think that's going to look like a pretty good handle. I'll run over the sander, cut the edges off. I think that'll make a perfect handle. Okay, we got two heads here, and neither one of them are too bad of looking, but I was going to take, it doesn't really matter, I guess they're both about the same. Then I'm going to work on, uh, probably have to cut this down a little smaller and get a hole drilled through the center of this. So I'm going to work on that now, to get a hole drilled through one of these, and we'll then we'll shape this handle to uh, fit inside one of them. All right, we're going to go ahead and try to drill a hole through this. We're not going to go all the way through, probably about three quarters of the way, and then I think that'll be fine. This is a light-duty wooden hammer. We're not going to use this to beat, you know, big heavy chunks of metal. 
but uh, just basically work on my knives. All right, that should do it. It's got a pretty good hole down in there. Time we glue this thing all together, it should be good. It wobbles around a little bit in there because I don't have the vise <coughs> bolted down, but it'll work. The rest of this I'll shave down with a, just a piece of sandpaper to get it nice and tight in there. I think that's going to work pretty good. So now we're going to have a wooden hammer. We're going to get some glue and glue it on. Then uh, maybe we'll throw a little coat of clear on it. Now I'm going to tap that down in there a little bit. I'm going to clean our screwdriver there and clean this hammer up a little bit where we got some glue on the outside of it there I'm sure we got plenty in there I'll probably throw a coat of clear on this and that should be our hammer so I'm gonna go ahead and clean up here and uh, Get that sanded down again. We'll just buff over it a little bit and throw some clear on. Should be a good old hammer. Hopefully it'll put some, uh, we could put some good use to it, making some more knives. Now we'll have a nice wooden hammer to where we won't have to worry about scarring up the wood. This should work out pretty good. Well, I think the hammer turned out pretty good. You can tell it's homemade, but that's okay. I'm going to use it in my garage. I never had a wooden hammer, never really had a need for one. But when I started working on the knives, I wanted to be able to put the, the wooden piece down on the brass uh, pins for the handle. And the last time I was using the butt end of the hammer. So now I got just a little hammer I can use to tap them down on with. I think it'll last me for a long time. I'm not going to use it for anything extreme just the handles on the knives so i hope you guys enjoyed watching my video don't forget to subscribe leave me thumbs up thumbs down or comment if you'd like till next time